There are a lot of diehard Vikings fans, we know this, but our next guest might be able to top them all. Yeah, she's the official Vikings fan for the year. And watch as she found out that she became fan of the year from a visit from Justin Jefferson. I just want to congratulate you. You have been a Minnesota Vikings fan of the year. I got you this little jersey for you, fan of the year. <laughs> the Vikings say it would be tough to find someone more deserving than this year's fan of the year. Her name is Olaf, and she's the mother of four and a native of Iceland. Plays tackle football, and she's a nurse. Welcome to the show. Thank you. You do it all. Um, I don't know about that. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much. Okay, tell us first of all how you became a fan of the Vikings because you were living in Iceland. Well, it's I can blame my husband. Blame your husband. <laughs> blame my husband. Um, he's a Vikings fan. He grew up in uh, Minnesota. Okay. Uh, we met at my aunt's house uh, back in the day. And he was watching football, like streaming the game online. I don't know how. Uh, and so we, he was staying up late, and our, because of our children, like we, our newborn, they like you know you're up with the kids. You sure are. So we were just watching the game. And you were saying football was not something that you normally watch. It's not really. No, no. Nice like thing. I didn't know about. It. I like. I knew that football existed in the world, but that was that was about that it. I was it. Yeah, that was it. So you moved here is it 2016? Yeah. And what was your first game experience like having just watched it from overseas for a while? Oh gosh, it was just amazing. It just blew my mind. <laughs> Did it? Yeah, totally. What it was is awesome. it? What is it about football that immediately you were like, "Yep, I like that." And I like the Vikings. <laughs> um I know this might not sound very feminine, but I like the tackling. <laughs> <laughs> but you play football too. How did you get into playing football? Um, so I wanted to learn football, learn the rules, so I could play with my boys. Um, like we have three boys. Uh, and my husband loves football, and so we play a lot of football. Uh, so I wanted to take the kids camps with Coach Grant at Eden Prairie High School. You wanted to be in the camp? Yeah, so I could learn, you'd sure. like, you just have to learn it by doing. Yeah. So I asked him if I could take his camp. And he's like, hmm, you, should, you have a good arm and you're very athletic. You just try out for the team, like Minnesota Vixen. So I just did that and made the team. Uh, and, that, <laughs> and that's how I started playing. It's incredible, your story. Okay, so now what position do you play? You're the quarterback? No, I played defensive end. Defensive end, okay. How about when it comes to watching the Vikings, do you have a favorite player? I mean, is it Justin Jefferson? It's okay if it's not. No, it is Jefferson. It is him? Okay. Yeah. Is that why I know it should be Griffin or Hunter because they play my position, but it's, I, I like Jefferson because he's an like, awesome player and he keeps his cool because football can be very intense yes. and components might say things you don't like, but he keeps, he, st he stays cool. But he's also a nice person outside of football. And I, I value that. Yeah. Did you know that day that you were going to be presented oh, with this? Did you know that no, it would be Jefferson? No, I did not have a clue. <laughs> not a clue. When did you put it, I mean, did it take him saying it or did you realize once you saw him what something was going oh, on? When I saw him. Yeah, I don't know. Something, something's up here. How do you feel about Packer fans? Um, have you picked up that rivalry too? No. No? Okay. No. No, I don't. But I am. Uh, I, I notice it more because we are Vikings fans. Mm -hmm. um, but some of my teammates are Packers fan. Um, so no, I just try to stay down to earth and the Justin just Jefferson not, like mode. Yeah, yeah, yeah just, keep it cool. Yeah, <laughs> and I just they have the right to cheer on whatever team. It's their choice, and I just try to respect other people's choices. You know, you're from Iceland, which has connections to Vikings. Does that play a role at all in your love for the Vikings? A little bit, yes. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't hurt, right? <laughs> oh, no. I and it, you work as a nurse, too. Yeah, yeah. And, and I don't know when you find time to do all these things. I'm impressed. I know it's been a, know. a very challenging year to be a nurse. You have kids, you play football. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, it's, uh, it takes a village, Yeah. like they say. 
And I just have this internal motivation to do my best uh, for me, for my family, and I just do it. And then you get rewarded sometimes. Like awesome surprises, I know, right? I know. It all pays off. That might be why they made you fan of the year. I like know. mother four, nurse on the Vixens, cheers us on every game too. So. Has Viking roots. Has yeah. Viking yeah. roots, yeah. exactly. Check, 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 check. Yeah, check. very yeah. deserving. Yeah. yeah. Well, thank you so much for joining thank us. You. We so appreciate it and hearing your story. Again, Olaf, thank you. And if you want to watch this uh, segment again, you go to our Good Day Facebook page. We will be posting it there.